Hey everybody, I'm Tyler and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be making this foldable rolling drying rack so when you're painting or spraying your material you can stack 20 drawer or door faces on this thing and get on with your painting. So this is the plan here. This is going to be 66 and a half inches high from the casters to the top of the post here. And I'm going to use stuff that I have on hand so there'll be a mix of 2x4 for the bottom here and 2x6 for the top and 1x2 and some plywood that I'll cut up for this. I do want to make it folding so I'll have some hinges in here. Hopefully this will work so that the mechanism will, will compact so that I can slide it away without using up too much room. We'll have a dado here on the bottom. These are 40 inch arms that'll be one and a half inches thick. So let's see what happens. I'm going to start with the base first and make sure that this concept will even work. Okay, that's gonna take forever. I was gonna try to not put the dado blade in because I just had it in yesterday, but we're gonna change the dado blade. In the long run, it'll probably save us some time. So it looks pretty good right now. I am definitely gonna put some clips right here that you kind of ratchet together to make this act more as one board. That'll help stabilize things a bit and it will prevent it from folding up as I'm rolling it around with any doors on there. And then up here, I think I'm gonna add one more support that folds up this way. 
and that'll just that'll just rest into place so there won't need to be a latch on that and that'll help with any wobbling up at the top here these little brackets to go right in here i don't think they're necessary by any means but it will probably help with the longevity of this thing putting the rails on and I realized that my stabilization mechanism on the top here is going to take away one of the rails. I was hoping to get 11 on here but I'm going to put one more here and if I didn't have this I could put one more on the top but I think we'll just go for 10 and move this up to around here so that when it's folded up it's kind of sticking up a little bit higher but then that allows me to get 20 drawers on this rack. Well, that is a wrap right there, and I gotta say, for a quick concept, this thing turned out pretty cool. We will see how it is when we have 20 door faces on here, but I think it will be pretty sweet. It's actually quite stable. I'm very surprised with that and very pleased. And as you saw, I got the little clips down here to lock it open. When you're all done, you just unclip those, give it a kick to fold it up a little bit, and pull on the top. And then I got a nice little bungee cord right here to hold it all together so that you can roll it around a little bit easier. And obviously those casters are very nice so that when you have your doors all painted up, you can roll it into a more climate controlled area if you don't have a spray booth or just get them out of the way so you can continue your work. And as you guys probably know, nobody really likes to paint. So anything that will help you out makes that job much easier. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it helped some of you guys out. If it did help you out, please hammer that thumbs up button. Helps us out a ton. And be sure to subscribe and hit that bell so you never miss when we upload a new video. I'm DIY Tyler. You guys have a good one. Ready to paint.